fall favorites video. Um, what's up? Today I'm going to be doing a fall favorites video. Um, it's not necessarily fall related, it's just things I've been liking the past couple months since like school started and it's been cooler out. Um, none of these have anything to do with the weather, um, but since it got cooler out, I guess I've been liking these things. So, um, the first thing I'm going to show you since he's right here. Um, for those of you who don't know, I love animals. Um, I actually work at Petco, so um, <laughs> I love taking care of them, I love learning about them, and I love rescuing them. So, I got this um, bearded dragon. As you can see, his name is Dexter. I actually just named him a couple days ago. I really couldn't think of a good name for him, but um, I settled on Dexter. Um, I adopted him from this uh, guy who didn't really take care of him. He didn't want him anymore. He really didn't um, care for him. Um, so I got him and now he's just loving life. He loves peppers so I go to the farmer's market and I get him peppers and I get my guinea pigs kale, peppers, any kind of vegetables. Um, and they get fed like every, <laughs> every morning they get fed so they're pretty happy so he's living a good life. Well he's backwards but um so it's Dexter. He is a he's a male leatherback, uh, bearded dragon. He's about four, they said. I don't think he's that old because he's not that big and he's shedding. I know they always shed, but he might be getting a little bigger. Um, I hope he gets a little bigger. So yeah, he's cool. I have him and I have my guinea pigs. I have my fish tank and um, that's all I have right now. My brother has my hamster. He's taking it when he moves out next week, so um, I'm going to miss him, but I can visit him and bring him treats and stuff, so. Um, but if you guys have any questions about Beard Dragons, um, let me know. I'll make a video on him. I actually eat uh, mealworms. I got these at work today, obviously, because when am I not at my job? But um, he loves, I'll show you eating, him eating it. Here, you want it? You want it? Mm, you want it? Yeah. <laughs> he loves his mealworms. He lo they're not mealworms. They're actually superworms. But um, he loves them. And he loves red peppers. So please, please, please don't rip my shirt. But yeah, so that's Dexter. Kind of item. Whoa, bud, where are you going? Ow. <laughs> Next favorite is um, a Bath and Body Works candle, and I used to work at Bath and Body. Um, <laughs> um, that was quite the adventure. Um, it kind of reminds me of like a bonfire, that kind of ashy smell to it. That sounds terrible, but it's um, woodland spruce, cedar, clove buds, and smoky vanilla. I, I burned one already. But um, I went and I got another one because I really liked it. Um, they have cute little tops for the fall. Uh, the fall candles are starting to go away soon. So you guys better go grab them before they run out. And then Fresh Balsam takes over. So my next favorite is actually this book. I picked this up at the thrift store. Um, it's all about like astrology, the moon, the sun, the planets. Super informative book. I did my book collection video. Um, I didn't have this when I did that, so I couldn't include it, but I wish I could because it's really cool. And it's definitely a spiritual kind of thing because it does talk about astrology. Um, it has some sky charts in it, which is really cool because it shows you all the constellations. Um, like where this where like the moon is uh, for different planets the different moons of the different planets um, some pictures of stars um, it's really pretty so it talks about like the solar system um, and then in the beginning it talks about like naming a star um, like this how the earth like rotates and stuff that's like a really trippy picture that's really cool I like that but um yeah, so what are you doing? Ugh, you child. I would definitely recommend this book. You could probably find it on Amazon. 
uh, for super cheap. If I get a chance, I'll link it down below um, where you can get it on Amazon or like Barnes and Noble or something. Um, but yeah, that's that book. My next favorite um, is actually another thrifted item. And if you didn't see my other thrift store video, go check it out because this is in it. Um, but it is this mirror. Oh my god, I absolutely love this mirror. Um, I think it is super pretty. I look at it, I use it to put my makeup on. That goes on the wall over there. Love it, I think it's so pretty. I looked it up on Etsy and people are selling them for like $59. I, I got mine for like $2 at the thrift store. So, you know, yeah. Last item and my probably second favorite item because obviously Dexter is my favorite item, but my second favorite item of the fall so far has been my ukulele. Um, um, might be a little out of tune. Um, I played it last night, but but yeah, it's so fun. I love this thing so much. Um, it's super cool. Um, I've been dying to learn to play this since like high school. So I actually just went on Amazon, found a relatively cheap, but not the cheapest one. It's uh, newer. That's the brand. Yes, my mom just came in clutch. She brought me some pumpkin spice, pumpkin creamer, pumpkin goodness, coffee. That's actually a favorite of the uh, fall, has been pumpkin coffee. I've never drank coffee before, but... I had pumpkin coffee for the first time uh, probably three weeks ago and I haven't stopped drinking it ever since. So this is with me wherever I go, work, school, sleep, filming video, yeah, yep, pumpkin, 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 pumpkin. It might not be in tune, but um, I haven't played it in a couple days. But yeah, it's super cool. Um, I learned how to play The Judge by 21 Pilots um, a little bit. I know the notes, um, just the strumming pattern and the singing at the same time kind of throws me off. I can't sing. I'm not going to sing. Like, I'm not going to torture you. But um, yeah, I absolutely love this. Um, I've been playing it. I have the iUke app, I guess. Um, I guess that's what it's called. Um, I've been using that to like tune, how to learn notes, how to learn strumming. Um, it's actually a super cool app, so check that out. That's been a favorite too. But yeah, I kind of want to get a case for it. kind of want to make a case for it, but I just don't have the time. Um, so yeah, that's my ukulele. I talk about other things that aren't things, but they're still favorites. Um, I absolutely, absolutely, I know I'm late to the game, but I absolutely love, um, what's the name of it, uh, Stranger Things. Some co-workers from work went to Comic-Con and they met Eleven, which I was, like, super jealous. I was, like, she is, like, perfect, but, um, that show has been, like, my number one music-wise. Um, Connor Roberts, um, <laughs> my life, um... He hasn't been number one since like freshman year college, but highly recommend him, Bright Eyes, listen to him. He's coming out with a new album next month. Definitely give that a listen. Um, Noise Floor is probably my favorite album by him, like overall out of all his music he's ever created, but um, I have been streaming this album over um, the record thing, and it is, it is a hundred, like it is beautiful. It's lot, it's, it's so low acoustic, so it's like, really, his voice is like amazing, his, his lyrics are like amazing, his voice like, has like, that feeling in it, that like, you just understand, like, you know, like, he gets you, you get him, like, you know, but, um, I saw him in, uh, oh my god, I saw him in June in Brooklyn at, uh, Northside Festival, with the Felice Brothers. Um, he played a couple of the songs that were on the album, so definitely check that out. Um, it's amazing. Uh, his new album's called Ruminations. His other album is Upside Down Mountain, his solo album. The one before that 
is self-titled, I believe. Um, and I forget the name of the other one. So check those out. Check out Bright Eyes. Check out the Mis uh, Connor Burst and the Mystic Valley Band. One of my kind. That album is like amazing. So Ruminations is obviously my favorite for the fall. Um, I want to see him in concert. He's playing Carnegie Hall in the city. Um, no, the day before Thanksgiving, um, in November. So <laughs> I'm praying to God that I make their safe. Yeah, those are my favorites. Um. Link's going to be in the bio for my Instagram, my Etsy shop, where I make, like, cool crystal jewelry, um, dream catchers, boho, hippie kind of stuff. Um, going to link my Facebook, Instagram, Etsy, email, all those fun things. Like this video, comment what your favorite things were for the fall, and subscribe. It's free. It's, oh, it's either over there or over there. Um... So subscribe, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.